Hello, I'm with the University of Arkansas Division of Agriculture Cooperative Extension Services. I'm Pamela Luker, the Pope County Family Consumer Science Agent. Today, I would like to speak to you about the family table and why it's important that we take the time to sit down and eat together with our family. Let's start by being real. It's difficult to find time to make sure your family gets a balanced meal, let alone have time to sit down at the table and eat together. Our schedules are busier than ever between work, school, and extracurricular activities. Sometimes making time for each other can even be a daunting task for us. Why does family mealtime matter? Well, research shows that there are benefits to both children and parents who have meal, family meal time. Children who participate in consistent family meal times eat an overall healthier diet, consume more fruits and vegetables, maintain healthy body weights, perform better academically, develop larger vocabularies. These same children are also less likely to engage in risky behaviors, including tobacco, drug, and alcohol use, struggle with dis uh, disordered eating, and experience less depression or low self-esteem. It's to parents who engage in family meal times are that they have overall healthier diets, enjoy strengthened family bonds, spend less money on food by eating at home more frequently, and are able to model healthy eating habits. So getting the family on board. It is important to get everyone on board with participating in family meal times. So first you need to get other adults in the home on board. Communicate with everyone when you're going to start and how often you plan on having family meal time. It's recommended that you have at least three family um, dinners together a week. Get started by practicing these tips from family life specialist, Dr. Brittany Schritt. First, keep things simple. You do not have to have a big formal meal. Even if you are eating sandwiches on paper plates, you can still sit down at the table and eat together. Turn off screens. Leave tablets, uh, phones, and other devices elsewhere in the house and don't have them at the table. Relax. Unless you are really in a hurry, avoid rushing through those meals. Be patient and be practical. If someone else, or if something else is on the schedule for that evening, do not rush everyone. Instead, you could offer um, something that is, can be eaten and cleaned up more quickly. Engage. Talk to your kids. Talking to your kids is never a waste of time. Ask them questions and give them time to answer them. Let them ask you questions. What happens if it doesn't go well? It's okay if it does not go as planned. Benefits of failure outweigh the risk. Remember, it takes practice. If you have questions or would like more information, you can contact me, Pamela Luker, at the Polk County Extension Office at 479-968-7098 or by email at pluker at uaex.edu. Also like my Facebook page at UAEX, Pope County Family and Consumer Sciences, or follow my blogs at River Valley Ramblings, which is on the uaex.edu website. Thank you.